This conference will now be recorded. Okay. Uh, so uh, we are starting our next topic, that is uh, stock transfer and transfer posting. So the, the topics that we are going to cover uh, there. Okay. We will see procedure for uh, stock to stock transfer posting. Okay. Prerequisite for material to material transfer posting. Okay. One step and two step procedures for stock transfers. We'll cover this. Then entry of a storage location from storage location to storage location. Stock transfers between plants of a company code using one step and two step procedures. Okay. Then stock transport order. Okay. Carry out stock transfer with reference to a stock transport order. So these are the topics we will be covering. Okay. So basically, uh, stock transfer and transfer postings for organizational reasons okay or due to some other factors okay internal transfer postings and physical stock transfers may be necessary so some in the industries normally what happens is uh, they will be keep on moving the stocks from uh, plant to plant or within the plant from storage locations so they will be doing all these activities so those are called stock transfers okay and also at the same time there will be a transfer posting okay transfer posting is like a physical goods movement will not happen okay but stock category okay or stock type so those things will change okay sometimes even the material number of the stock will change so those comes under transfer postings okay in case in the case of transfer postings the key aspect is a change in the stock id number or the stock category of a material so here uh, physical movement may not happen okay only the stock category or the material number of the stock may change okay transfer postings do not need any do not involve an actual goods movement so in the in the, in the transfer postings there is no actual goods movement okay so this one examples of transfer posting stock to stock means quality to unrestricted use okay sometimes stock is in quality inspection quality inspection is completed then you will move it to unrestricted use okay just changing the stock category or material to material transfer this also we will see okay another case is stock transfer so in the case of stock transfer on the other hand there is always a physical movement of goods in the stock transfer you will have a goods movement the examples are storage location to storage location or plant to plant okay so we will see all these things in the system so these are the ones we discussed you either you have transfer posting or physical stock transfer so in the transfer posting this is like changing the stock type or material number or even batch number so physical movement may happen or may not happen it depends so like this example stock to stock material to material consignment to warehouse whereas another one is physical stock transfer so this one storage location to storage location transfer plant to plant transfer or company code to company code uh, plan stock transfer from a plant belonging to one company code to the plant belonging to the another company code okay and here you have physical material movement and uh, this can be done in one step or two step we will see this in the system okay so first we'll start with the transfer posting okay so transfer posting normally uh, of two types stock to stock and material to material okay The first one is stock to stock. Stock to stock. Next one is material to material. Material to material. Okay. So stock to stock means if the usability, if the usability of a material changes, you must make transfer postings between different stock types. Okay there are 
three stock types in the inventory management that indicate the usability of a material like unrestricted use stock, approved stock, quality inspection, stock in quality inspection, or blocked stock. Okay, so this is the one. If you see here, this is the one. Let's say you have a plant. In the plant, there is a storage location. Okay, in that you have a material. So let's say the material is in quality inspection, for example. Okay, now this stock, after a certain period, I want to change it to unrestricted use stock, approved stock. So they will do stock to stock transfer. This is 321. Okay, so quality to approved. Now reverse way, approved to quality, 322. And at the same time, you have you can transfer blocked stock to quality inspection, 349 movement time. And quality to block, 350. And also at the same time, if the stock is in unrestricted use, directly you can transfer it to blocked stock. Movement type is 344. And from block to unrestricted use, 340. Reverse. So all these you can do. But here the stock will not be physically moving. Stock will be in the same plant, in the same storage location. Only stock category is getting changed. Stock categories are getting changed. Okay. So first we will see this. So first I will transfer some stock to quality to unrestricted use. Okay. So let me log in. So to got this now one, uh, I see uh, one more stock type as reserved stock. So is it different or is it one yeah, of the no, same kind? You no, know, same, same type. Approved stock only, it is just reserved. That's all. It, it, there is no separate uh, this thing. Okay, let me log in. I'll take this material 3453 three, plant is thousand okay execute here if you observe this material in this plant plant thousand in this story location there is some stock in quality inspection you see this is a quality inspection and you have unrestricted use so now we will move it to quality to unrestricted use approved okay so this is the batch number okay so now we will do that. So what you need to do is this one in the you have to use the transaction as usual. Miko, Miko. Here you need to select transfer posting and other, other, and then system will propose a movement type. But according to the uh, transfer you are doing, you need to change the movement type. You need to change the movement. Type. Okay. Then you have to enter all the information material code, plant, storage, location, all those things from and to, to if required and quantity and everything. Okay, so everything has to be entered here manually okay? because there is no reference document here. Okay, so now let's go to Miko. I'll open one more session. Go to Miko. Okay, so now select transfer posting. Transfer posting other other okay accordingly it will propose a movement type but in our case the movement type is we are transferring stock from quality to unrestricted use approved the movement type is 321 okay so now change our movement type enter okay now you need to enter the enter the all the information okay so what is the material the material is Material is 321. Material is sorry, 3453. 3453. Enter the material code. Okay. Plant. This is the plant. This is a story location. Same. You are transferring to same story location. Okay. Now enter the batch. So what is a batch? 881. Enter the batch. Okay. Same batch. Everything same. Only you are changing the stock category. Okay, now what is the quantity? 100. Enter 100. So the thing you need to understand here is 
you have to enter everything manually from and to destination here it is using from and to destination you have two blocks here okay of course everything 